Okay, next uh, we're going to take a look at uh, a little more detail about this Microsoft support site on why can I get online. But um, on this particular video, we're going to use the network troubleshooter and try to go through um, and let Windows 10 kind of try to figure out why are we having uh, Wi-Fi connection issues. So we're going to create an issue. I'm going to disconnect um, uh, my wireless adapter um, signal from my wireless router. So um, just to start off, I'm going to tell you I'm going to put this link at the top of the description of, the, of this video so you can go and click on it yourself and kind of get familiar with the page a bit. But let's go ahead and jump right into it here. Okay, so the network troubleshooter is something that is in Windows 10 that can be um, it can be nice at times. It can it'll normally what it wants to do is go through and figure out what the issue is and it just kind of traces through and starts with your adapter on your um, computer and sometimes it'll reset that. Sometimes there might be a DNS issue it tells you to kind of reset that and or your wireless uh, router might be having an issue and you have, have to go reset that yourself but some of this um, the network troubleshooter can do on its own so let's go and do that right now let's first uh, tr uh, pull up the network troubleshooter and you're gonna go over to the bottom left hand corner where this little Windows start icon is and you're gonna click on the start button and see this little gear settings here if, if you hover over it, it'll say settings and you'll uh, click on it go to network and internet and then you can see um, a listing of your network status uh, along with changing into adapter settings uh, sharing options uh, your home group um, you can see available networks around you and then the thing uh, the uh, animal we're looking for is network troubleshooter let's go ahead and click on that and right now I don't have any problems with um, with uh, my wireless network connection so it's gonna pull up uh, a default kinda like what problem are you having I'm you know we're able to get to a website um, but let's go ahead and create an issue so I'm gonna I'm gonna cancel this out and I am going to turn this on and let's set um, let's turn on airplane mode airplane mode will disconnect our uh, uh, wireless signal from our wireless router um, if you're running a laptop sometimes they ask you to turn off the settings and you can see once I did that let me do that again so let me turn turn this back on you can see here the red not connected uh, in a second it should refresh and, and say I'm connected and when you click airplane mode you'll see that it's a dynamic update which is nice and it immediately says hey do you want to troubleshoot? It actually moved that um, network troubleshooting from uh, below home group to right at the top here. So it kind of jumps around on you. But if you're having issues, this is where you want to start. So let's click on troubleshoot and let's, uh, I haven't done this, so let's let's see what's going to happen here. Okay, it's pulling up and uh, it went through and detected, hey, you know, you've got airplane mode on. Uh, let me fix this for you. So let's apply this fix. It's going to res try to resolve our problem. You know, it's going through its machinations here. Looks like <clears throat> it went through and said, "Okay, either you have an Ethernet cable not plugged in, and uh, since you know I don't have a, you know, I'm not connected to LAN via network cable. Uh, it's Wi-Fi." It went through the next step and said, "Okay, your Wi-Fi adapter is disabled, and um, the wireless capability is turned off." So all it did was take airplane mode and it looks like, oh, let's speaker, sorry, um, and turn it back on. So airplane mode is still on, <laughs> so this must be a bug, uh, and, and uh, that troubleshooter was able to get us around, but let's go, I'm gonna go ahead and turn that off, um, which is what it's supposed to do, is it, it should have turned, um, it should have turned um, airplane mode off, but instead it just kind of went around it and, uh, and got us internet access back. But hopefully that's a quick run through of network troubleshooting, you know how to get to it, and hopefully it can resolve uh, the issue you might be having. Good luck.